Hello and welcome to episode 49 and for this video I'm joined by Keith again getting quite a regular now yeah yeah it's right, yeah <laughs> and um, we've come down to uh, Chadlington Lake which is a uh, near a uh, sort of Chipping Norton area uh, nice little lake it's about an acre in size maybe acre and a half it's on a sort of on the back of a farm and it's in very sort of peaceful sort of tranquil settings no main road so you've got nice peaceful fishing here uh, we came here last week didn't we to uh, give it a bash because it had been a couple of years since I'd been here and um, just thought I'd, we'd uh, sort of test the water so to speak before we'd done any filming and uh, we yeah, had a really 200, nearly 200 pound of fish yeah I, I reckon easily 200 yeah. pound of fish each I've been uh, diplomatic <laughs> <laughs> so um, you're not going to see any monsters today from this lake this is going to be a, a little fun session pasty bashing isn't it yeah I mean, trying to get grassy really aren't we? Yeah, I, mean, I think the average size of fish we were catching last week was um, four. two, three, four pounders. Ah, oh, it's your phone. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Delkin Miller on your phone. Oh, right. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so, push you and go. So yeah, we're not going to catch any monsters. This is purely sort of a pasty bashing lake where you can come just for a good day's fishing, enjoy your fishing get lots of runs, like I say, between us we easily had, well, about 400 pounds of fish between us, oh, didn't we? Easy, really. we had easy. Sometimes two at a time. Yeah, so it was mental. We, I mean, we was catching common carp, mirror carp, ghost, ghost carp, orths, tench, you had a golden orth. And a bream. And and, a bream. Oh yeah, and bream. And roach. <laughs> but what we're really after here that's in there, not many, but there are in here, is grass carp. That's what we're, that's that's the PL or resistance as they call it if you can catch one of them. Yeah. So anyway, stop waffling. Get on with it. Let's yeah. go fishing. <laughs> it's got the two thumbs up. Alright. Two foot. Two thumbs Let's go fishing. <laughs> first fish first fish of the day. About five minutes, only been out five minutes, literally. Um, on two grains of corn. We're not gonna spend too much time talking about them because we expect to get a lot of them. So anyway, she's about four and a half, five pound. Right, we'll put that back then and get on for the next one. Right then guys, literally two minutes after Keith's fish, my first one. Probably, I don't know, two to three pound mark. Absolutely cracking scale patterns on the mirrors here. This is the kind of stamper fish we're uh, likely to get all day. Not big, just nice looking fish. Good fun fishing. Well, literally a couple of minutes after Chris has caught his fish, I've just caught myself a tench. Uh, what can I say? It's a tench. Lovely looking fish. Get it back. Another one is about five minutes. A little, oh, a little ghosty this time. Uh, well, three pound at most. But still puts a little fight up. Can you? Hey. Eh? Well, um, back it goes then before I lose it. <laughs> right then, guys. Another, another <laughs> two a, for me. Literally one, out, both at the same time. And at the same time, you got one. I had one as well. Yeah. But sweet. Mine seems a bit more lively. Yeah. <laughs> right then, guys. Nice and lively. Uh, your first tench of the day. Only a couple of pound. Still put up a nice little fight. <laughs> right then guys. Me uh, first comment of the day. A little, uh, I don't know, probably not even two pounds. One and a half pounds. Cracking little fish. Was just on the phone to me mate Mark at work. Phoned me up to say how I'm getting on. And in the middle of the phone call, right hand rod raced off. Uh, let's get it back. Right then. Fishing's a bit slow today, but another little common. Oh! <laughs> Tensing up like mad. There we go. Another absolutely mint little common. Just good fun fishing today, catching these little, catching these little uh, 
these little pasties. A slight tackle, saw fish, good fun. Get back. Right then guys, been a bit quiet for the last few hours, but after a few hours wait, got another little one. As it is a bit quiet, drop the rods into the margins, right rod, right margin, left rod, left margin, and uh, right rod went with this uh, one, so perhaps the fish are in closer than what we thought they would. Right. Oh, good save, cracking little little uh, mirror. Uh, let's get it back. Alright then guys, just going to uh, run through the rig and method I'm fishing this session. Exactly the same as, uh, as I was asked fishing uh, last week when I was absolutely bagging up. Been a bit slower this session, that's for sure, for some strange reason. But anyway, I'm fishing one of the... Uh, well, I'm fishing exactly the same on both rods. I'm fishing one of the um, Guru X feeders. Only a small one, 24 gram. And a uh, very short braided hook link. A size 10 Guru MWG hook. And a, well, I've been fishing some of them double, but a little 8mm strawberry pellet, which is a. Uh, there you go, one of the Sonya baits. Sort of strawberry S pellets. Looks like sometimes I've been using one, sometimes two. And they're the 8mm. Keith's got some 11mm as well, which I had to go on as well. Which the last fish didn't come on in it, an 11mm. But mostly these little ones. So, yeah, very good method to fish. And all you do. I got some uh, pellet there, which I uh, soaked and softened last night. I pre-prepared them yesterday, and then all I do is put the pellet and on that. See our little platform on the feeder. The pellet, and we hook bait. Whatever you're fishing, just sits on there. And I don't use a mould or anything. Just my hand. into that pellet, make it a nice little shape and that's it. I don't worry too much about getting it all nice and round like you would with a mould. Just press it on with your hand and that's it. And that's what's been getting me a fish this session. It's what caught me at about £200 of fish last week. I'm on the same peg but it's just not fishing like it was last week. Right, I'm going to drop this one back down into the margins and then see if uh, the same can happen. Right then guys, not long after I had one on the right hand margin, got a nice fish off the left hand margin. I weighed this one, five pounds seven ounces, nice fully scaled mirror. Didn't have to put up any fight whatsoever because as soon as he hooked he swam towards me, but absolutely cracking looking fish. Uh, fish don't have to be big, big when they look this pretty. But biggest fish of the day so far. Cracking. Let's get it back. Yeah, just one just straight after Chris in the margins. Nice little tiddly thing, pretty thing. Anyway, let's get it back. Alright then guys. No sooner as I'd put me uh, left hand rod back out. The right hand margin rod just went off again. Stunning little common. 
almost got a bit of sort of cruising shape to him, but uh, yeah, cracking little fish. Let's get it back. Ah, another one. It's draining him hard, he's got absolutely mental pull down the back. Lovely little one. A pound. Anyway, I'll put my back. Nice knock ins, just packing the rods up actually, and he just tore off. A nice little common, about a pound. Anyway, I'm going to put her back, or he in this case. Alright, bye. Right then, guys, that's it, we've come to the end of our day session. You get the first fish, last fish. I, mean, I, wasn't, I wasn't counting how many fish we had, but. <laughs> it wasn't quite as many as no. we had uh, last week, was it? No, it was quite Absolutely. disappointing actually. Well, uh, we probably had as many fish shit all day today as we were getting per hour. every hour yeah, yeah. last week. Yeah, but you know, we've had several fish each, so you know, it's been oh, okay. Well, you know, we've, double figures all the time. Yeah, we've been catching, so uh, I mean, you're packed up now, aren't you? Oh. Yeah, no, no. Oh, we're oh. over there now. Yeah. Quick, just unpack. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll still hop. I've only got my rods left to pack up, they're on the ground, but that's it. Yeah, it's been a fun little pasty bashing session again, hasn't it? So, yeah. Which is what you know, little venues like this is all about. Fun, yeah, so. Yeah. Alright, and right, that's it. Thanks for watching this episode, and I will see you next time, wherever that may be. Right, thank you.